A community is pulling together tonight, three days after an EF1 tornado ripped through the small town. County officials were there today assessing the damage and what needs to be done to help those most affected. CW50's April Morton spoke with a business owner who's turning the devastation into something positive. Mother Nature wreaked havoc on Armada Saturday evening, but her destruction didn't break the town's spirits. Instead, it's showing the true nature of some neighbors. A few people come out grilling all day. Um, we've been out here pretty much 99 um, every day, kind of helping where we can. And that's pretty much been the response from people we spoke with here in Armada on Tuesday. Everyone chipping in where they can to help out their fellow neighbor. Justin Zebra owns Armada in Michigan. The market that features homemade products by local artisans sits on the corner of Maine and Fulton in downtown Armada. Unlike others in the area, the business didn't get the brunt of the damage, but it did lose its brand new roof. Oh, our entire roof got lifted off and thrown over here. Zebra says thankfully no one was home when the roof from his building crashed through this nearby house. His business, like many others, has no power, but instead of letting the meats and items spoil, he and neighboring businesses have been grilling in the park, providing thousands of meals for residents and workers out here. After a crisis like this with a tornado, for people to say, you know what, uh, there's an uplifting spirit here. It's, it's surprising, but it is. That's the thing I see most when I walk around this town not the damage. Macomb County Executive Mark Hackle assessed the area Tuesday along with the emergency management director. He says there's no way of telling just yet the dollar amount of the damage, but says it will probably be in the millions. He says about three to five homes and a handful of businesses have serious damage, but thankfully there were no injuries. In Armada, April Morton, CW50 News at 10.